estamos caminando a Puente, Puente Mastute Rimes. Uh, en la noche uh, hay muchas luces, uh, muchos colores, y, uh, ma muy maravilloso. ¿Sí? <laughs> so, uh, we're going to a bridge and it's called Mastute Remus or something. And uh, at night there's supposed to be a lot of pretty lights. Uh, we're gonna take a walk there. It's about an hour and a half walk. Um, traffic hour right now, but we're walking so it's not, doesn't count towards us. And then we're making some big plans tomorrow. I'll tell you guys more about it along the way. But right now, gonna try to stay cool, not get too hot. So Juan and I are a little bit perplexed about the road system here. Uh, there's basically three lanes, if you will. There's that big middle one that you see, and then there's one right here next to us, and then on the other side, there's another one. And they all go in the same direction, except on ours, where you see it's a two-lane road. So, <laughs> The road system is a little bit whack here, but uh, I guess if you're used to it, it's okay. Um, and we were just talking about the weather in Monterrey, how it's a lot hotter than here. Here it's uh, it's it's bearable. It's not humid. It's more like a dry heat, and I, I can deal with that. Like we're literally walking at 4:30 in the afternoon when it's like pretty hot outside, but <laughs> we're not sweating up a storm yet. Amphitheater. Concha acústica, avero, baños, mecas, mariposas. Where's the pool? Oh, that place is like for concerts. We just walk around, do a circle. Yeah. Yeah. Want to do that? We just got here to Parque Agua Azul and looks like it's a nice park. Today it's free, maybe? I don't know. Yeah, it's it's free, entrance. free entrance today. Just another nice park here that you can just go relax and enjoy time with your friends or family. Um, I'm sure they have events here and everything, but it's just a weekday, so nothing much is happening right now. Anyways. Our plans coming up is we're going to take a, a trip to Guanajuato and what I'm really excited about in Guanajuato is the colonial architecture there and just to see a different part of Mexico because uh, not all of Mexico is the same um, and it's more of an old school town you're going to get a mix of the mariachi bands and maybe some different kinds of foods, but I don't know, what are you excited about? Same, the architecture, uh, the food, hopefully some live music. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's about it for now. Yeah, so we're gonna take a bus. It was, I wanna say, $20 one yeah, way? $22, $20. About $22 one way. And it's about a four-hour bus ride. I'm not sure what kind of bus it is yet. Hopefully they have a restroom. It's going to be yeah, a four-hour yeah, bus yeah. ride. It's got a restroom. <laughs> it's got a restroom. Yeah. And uh, we're going to pack very minimally. And uh, just ride it out in the morning. Get there around noon. Catch some delicious foods. Hopefully they have some burrilla. <laughs> or some other things. Right now we're just enjoying a nice stroll to the park. See what's going on. Quiet, yeah. As you can see, people are just chillaxing. Yeah, it's a weird pyramid thing. Kids are climbing it, but... I think it's a greenhouse, right? Then this looks like some kind of aviary. Maybe birds, maybe monkeys. Maybe butterflies, I'm not sure. <laughs> They got little carts for kids. It's a lot. It's a lot. How'd you get in? I don't know how people got in. 
Maybe it's like a tour. Maybe. You think they'll put like animals in there? It's gotta be something. So this reminds me a lot of like Epcot, except you can see through it. What's that? Epcot? You never been to Epcot? It's like Disneyland. It's like a dome like this too. And I, I forgot what's inside. I went inside when I was really young. But it's not open air like this one. Um, is this a chocolate chip? Fine, that's fine bread. I don't know what it is. Uh, Yeah, chocolate croissant. Give me one of those. Yeah. Okay, welcome. This is a, um, a bakery. They sell all kinds of flavors. Cream, uh, guava, pineapple, pineapple. Just finished an awesome pastry from this panaderia here. And I got the croissant filled with chocolate. It was really good. And then what'd you get? Well, I got a kancha and I got like a soft cookie. It was really, it's not too sweet, but sweet. And then a coffee. And a coffee. Yeah. Uh, I think we've been walking, the total amount we ran and walked today, at least 10 miles. <laughs> We were dying, we needed something uh, to eat or drink because we're getting lightheaded. We're trying to walk yeah. to this bridge and it's pretty far, 10.3 yeah, miles, 23,000 steps. <laughs> yeah, we, uh, we got our steps in today, <laughs> to say the least. This is the neighborhood where we're at. <laughs> we're pretty close to the bridge. But it's not on yet, so we're gonna wander around a little bit. Oh, it's a hotel. Uh, hotel Rui Plaza. Okay. So here we are, this is the bridge, but it's not on yet. So we're gonna wander, come back, hopefully it'll be on. Light. Lights are coming on. It's just not dark enough yet, I think. Yeah. Yeah. All right, so Juan and I are here at a little taco stand that we found near uh, the bridge and uh, we're just waiting for our tacos. We both got beef tacos, but they had different names. Do you remember what, what yours was? That's a <clears throat> steak. I Spene, Benegio or something? Benegio, I don't know. And it had aracha, aracha pera? Aracha pera. Arachera. Arachera. Okay. And then this is horchata. It's basically corn, no, not corn, rice. Steak. It's a rice I, drink. I don't even know how to say it. <laughs> It's rice. Maybe. Right? Arroz, huh? I don't know. You don't know what our is? <laughs> I mean, I, I, I seen it. That they had to like grind it, but I don't uh, know if it's rice. Okay. And then Juan got the limonada. Yeah. So I just had some really good tacos. They were twice the price, but it was also a little bit larger too, so um, I thought it was fair. Did you like your taco? Pretty good. Yeah, he liked, he liked it. His lemon, lemonade was pretty good. My horchata was pretty good. I always get that for some reason. And uh, we're just gonna kind of wait the rain out since the bridge lights is, isn't on yet, isn't dark enough yet. 7.30? 754. 754. So we're gonna have to probably wait another 30 minutes or 45 minutes for the lights to come on. In the meantime, we're gonna tell a story. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> no story. <laughs> yeah, we're just gonna watch the traffic here. <laughs> So this area is close to Zapopan, but we're not quite there yet. It's kind of on the edge. If we walk maybe like 15 more or 20 more blocks, we'll probably get there. But yeah, just gonna hang around here. So just like DC, you can rent bikes if you want. 
I'm not sure how much it is, but let's have a like, look. Uh, One day is 80. So 80. Two bucks? Three? No, four. Four? Four dollars. But it says it limits to 30 minutes or no? That's one day, right? Um, okay, so one day it's 80, but if you look to the right here. Oh, uh, 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 30. 30 to 60 minutes. It's 20, so it's a dollar. Not bad. Not bad. So we are right here near the bridge, still waiting for our darkness to fall completely. So we can have this really cool view of the glow the bridge glowing but as you can see it's still kind of bright out so I'm not getting the full effect yet gotta hang on a little bit longer <laughs> okay so this is Jorge Matute Rimas he died in 2002 uh, he was a civil engineer yeah. Siglo 20th century or something like that yeah. and he did a bunch of stuff I'm not sure exactly what Looks like this bridge was named after him. Let's continue. <laughs> it's almost dark enough. We're just gonna fool around with some of these lights here, just for fun. Drone right above us. <laughs> this guy's flying a drone out in this area. See it? The green light? Yep. <laughs> That's dope. Do some poses, man. Yeah, it looks mad dope. Don't stand on it. Just do some poses. <laughs> Hurry up, do some poses. I go like this. Oh snap. Nice. I think I got it. Yeah, that way. Hold on, let me get closer. Oh, here we go. Let me get this real quick. So this is a Puente Matute, Matute Remus. Opened in 2011, suspended bridge. Displays virtual harmony. Why is that dude funny like crazy? <laughs> so Juan and I came back to the same place expecting to get some uh, arroz con leche or uh, I was expecting flan de Mexico but uh, instead they actually ran out so instead we decided to get the exact same thing we got earlier today because it was so good. <laughs> A little bit swampy though. And so ends our adventure. <laughs> we are standing in front of a Soriana close to where we were at the bridge and waiting for an Uber to get home because we are quite far out, about one hour and 30 minutes walking home. And at this hour, I don't know how sketchy it is in certain parts of the city, so instead of risking it, we're just gonna Uber home.